In terms of these other issues that require constitutional reforms, we have heard from the Azimio Brigade clearly stating that if it is the creation of the office of the Prime Cabinet Secretary as well as the office of the um, opposition leader, it should go to the people. It should not be a preserve of the parliamentarians to decide if these particular issues will be um, included in our constitution. It, is, it should go for a referendum. What is your point of view on that? I do not think that at the moment we as a country are ready for a referendum. Mm -hmm. We are not ready for any general election type of engagement as a country. Mm -hmm. uh, the economy is just starting to crawl. Mm -hmm. uh, we really need to put in a lot of work to strengthen and stabilize the economy. I, it will be uh, tiring, it's fatiguing to take people back to elections, even before they see fruits of uh, what they queued for mm -hmm. in 2022. So. It's neither wise, it's not safe. I do not think that uh, the government is keen on actually having a referendum or even having a general election type of uh, engagement going forward. Mm -hmm. uh, if there are issues that need constitutional reform, I think largely uh, uh, the government would be more uh, willing and leaning towards having those that can actually go the parliamentary way, especially if we have got a consensus. Mm -hmm. uh, the others that would need uh, anything other than a, a, a parliamentary process, mm -hmm. uh, that can wait and probably until the next general election, we can have it as a question in the general election in 2027. Mm -hmm.